pulled away. Nicely played. That will be a boundary. Every boundary will hurt England. Try and get that lead up above 300. Still need a partnership or two, this West Indies side. Remember, tomorrow will only be a day three pitch. It will still be a decent surface tomorrow. That's nicely played. Really nicely played. Off his hip. Back to back boundary, 71 for five. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Hetmeyer used his feet. Dorich just stood there, stand and deliver. The last few overs. Now they've got to think about the runs that are flowing in as much as they're still trying to get wickets. So can they hold their guard, England? and just weather this little storm on well, flurry of boundaries in order to get another wicket. And that's another element. This should go all the way. And does. So that's another element to consider in this, in this run chase by England. Yeah, just the mindset, getting one or two good partnerships going. And that's why that top order is so important, that top three. If you can dent the new ball burst, heads will drop. West Indies might lose their discipline a little bit. But unfortunately for England over the last few years, the top three haven't performed. It's always been a recovery phase. Second time round, England might put it right. Remember, England have won seven of their last eight test matches. Driven beautifully. Barrich now joining in, and the lead goes past 400. Yeah, this was beautifully played. Wasn't quite a half volley, hit it on the up. Good hands. Well, it's an odd field. Communication between captain and bowler. Stokes now having a word. 50 for Dowrich. And a lovely shot through. Wide mid on. Takes him to 53. Valuable knock. In the circumstances, the team, the innings was tottering yesterday. And the Windies lost five for nine. And having had a, a good year in 2018 with the bats in context of his teammates averaging 36. He starts the first test match of 2019 in good fashion. Beautifully done from Dowrich. He moves into the 80s with a back cut, his sixth four. 300 comes up for West Indies. Their lead is 513. Complimenting and competing with Jason Holder. Shot in the last over. 200 run partnership between the best of friends who've come through the system together. And a furrowed brow for Joe Root. Wow, we're on the driving range. One from Holder, one from Dowrich, sumptuous shots. You can tell a very close relationship between those two. going to that is a beautiful shot Anderson over pitching the straightest of bats sends this to the mid on boundary and Dowrich now is 95 it's one of the most beautiful strokes in the game the on drive we'll have a look at his balance that left elbow going high into the air and the full face presented Field is coming. 
trying to stop this single. Oh! Crowd are poised. Off he goes. Wait for it, wait for it. Dab it away for four behind square on the offside. Wonderful celebration, a terrific innings. Very well played, Shane Dorich. Stuck around, supported Jason Holder. Let's build that partnership. Never lost his cool. He's racked up his third test century. And that wasn't a, a big strong hit, but it was very delicate, and it brings him four. 400 up for the West Indies. The power of Holder at one end, and a little bit of touch and finesse of Dowage at the other. No third man. Just open the face, we'll have another four. And these two congratulated each other with every milestone, a little hug when they bring up a 50 or a 100, 150, 200 partnership, now the 400 for the innings. This one just goes past Stokes, it was deliberately played by Dowrich, but because Root bowls at a decent lick, almost 100 kilometres an hour, it's gone past Stokes in a flash. Stokes took a very good grab yesterday off Moen Alley to dismiss Chase. This one was a little bit wide of him. Not even Ben Stokes could get a mitt on that. Nicely played again. That's twice now off the seamer, now off the spinner. Just opened the face and taken the boundary. What a partnership. What a day for Jason Holder and Shane Dowrich, these two great friends who came together late yesterday when West Indies were not exactly in trouble but were enduring a collapse of their own and they remained unbeaten until after tea on the third day there is more work to do but Holder can enjoy this moment along with Dowrich the partnership unbeaten 295 Holder finishing 202 Dowrich 116 